I woke up at 2.30 in the morning to this. I mean, there's snow on the ground, and it's lightning outside. Look how cute you guys are. They love each other. Chance. I have to put Chance in every one of my videos because he's so stinking cute. Hey guys, I've been sick for the past few days, but um, me and my husband just went to the gym. Just got done working out. I feel really good. Um, I'm not, you know, all drowsy and stuff. I'm just stuffed up still and have a little bit of cough. But I'm feeling a lot better. But what I want to talk to you guys about today is about food. And how important it is to eat the right kinds of food. And know what you're eating. Me and my husband watched this documentary called Food Matters. And if you have Netflix... You can look it up. And it's a documentary on how food matters. And it tells you how when you cook your food, you know, you lose 50% of the protein and you only get 40% in your vegetables if you're lucky of all the nutrients and stuff. And not only does it help you stay fit, but it help you, helps you stay healthy. I haven't been... I mean, I've been eating okay, but when I eat my vegetables, I cook them. Almost every time I eat my vegetables, I'm cooking them. And that's one, probably one of the reasons I've been sick so much. is because I don't eat the right things, or I don't know. I didn't know I wasn't right e eating the right things. Do you know less than 6% of our doctors graduate with a nutritional degree? And that's the thing that they don't know. When you go to the doctors, what do they tell you? Well, drink plenty of fluids. They don't tell you to go eat anything. Well, because they don't know. They don't know that well, you need nutrients. Not only to stay fit, but to stay healthy, not get sick. I mean, in other countries... They're using high doses of vitamin C to cure cancer and get rid of tumors. In this Food Matters documentary, they had pictures of a guy with a huge tumor on his neck and a huge tumor in his chest. And in three months of high dose vitamin C doses, it was gone. The pictures, he looked like a different guy. I mean, and there's no cell damage. There's, it's, it's not harmful to his body. It's not harmful to other cells in his body. And they also showed this person with this nasty looking tumor on his hand. And in six months it was completely gone. His, his hand was just scarred up, of course. But it was completely gone. They're curing cancer. And all it is is high doses of vitamin C. But here in the United States it's illegal to practice nutritional therapy. So instead of using natural nutrition, we use radiation to cure cancer? But it doesn't cure it. It, it makes it worse. And, I mean, all this will really do is, is make you hate the government even more than you probably already do. And it'll make you... It's more of an inspiration to get healthy and to get fit. And it's actually inspired me and my husband to become vegetarians. And um, if we don't become vegetarians, we'll at least just eat chicken, which is what we really do anyways. But still, it has inspired us that much that we want to become vegetarians. And what do they tell you what the worst kind of nut for you is? Cashews. Well, yeah, they're really fattening for you. But what they tell you in this documentary is that cashews has a certain chemical in it that's basically an antidepressant. And if you eat two handfuls of cashews, you won't be depressed, basically. I mean, it won't take them completely away, but you're going to feel significantly better. And, 
I, I've been eating cashews just because they said that. I, I wanted to see because, you know, I, I work with kids and it, it gets stressful. So today at my lunch, I had cashews in my salad. And after my lunch, I, I felt significantly better. I felt very happy. And it's just weird how you have heard my entire life that cashews were the worst peanuts for you. You know, but really, they're the best. Go find this documentary. Food Matters. It rocks.